Good morning. We are at La Mandeline. It's a French bakery cafe. We're having brunch. And I got a quiche Lorraine. And then Ken got a ham and cheese. I don't know what it is. Like a... I don't know. It looks good though. It's almost like a croissant baked. We each got French onion soup. And then look at these little desserts. Ken got a salad. I think we'll probably split this. He got French onion soup and then he got a lemon little mini tart. How wonderful is that? Say good morning. Good morning. Hey, we just had breakfast at one of the coolest restaurants so far. It's called La Mandolin. And it's like uh, it's like a Texas Panera. But like homemade granny style. Like homemade, yeah. It was really good. And it's right next to Southern Mes Southern Methodist University in Dallas. SMU. SMU. Really super cute place. They got ribbons, yellow ribbons on the trees. Oh. Y'all know I'm so patriotic. This is SMU. And look at the church across the street. The Methodist Church. Oh my goodness. We bought the city pass and this is our last stop while we're here in Dallas. We're gonna be here at the George W. Bush Presidential Library and Museum Tour. So beautiful. These are gifts to the American people from the Middle East. Crazy. They said anything over $350, the president or the first lady was not, can't keep it as, you know, a personal item. They're gifts to the United States. But when they leave office, they can purchase them at full market value. Look at that. These are gifts from Africa, the different nations in Africa. Oh my goodness. Can you imagine riding a horse with those? <laughs> These are gifts from Asia. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Wow. These are gifts to the American people from Europe and Russia. Oh, look at that sculpture of the horse. Beautiful. Wow. Look at that. And a sword. These are gifts from the American people. Look at that belt buckle. Totally cool, huh? These are gifts to the American people from the Americas. Just beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful dress. Here's one of the menus from one of their state dinners. Thought you guys might like to see it. So this is a replica of the Oval Office. Ken's going to try his hand as an executive order there. <laughs> Mr. President, Mr. President. <laughs> Do you mind if I take your picture too? <laughs> <laughs> Remember when we were going through New Mexico in Arizona area and I told you about Frederick Remington? This is his bronze sculpture. It's called the Bronco Buster. Ken has this sculpture. I got it as a gift one year for Christmas, like when we were dating, <laughs> if you can believe that. But that's just beautiful. And here's the Oval Office. Christmas tree. Isn't this a beautiful room? Look at the ceilings and the crown molding and the uplighting. Mm -hmm. 
So beautiful. Now I'm going to get the ceiling. The seal. Let me get the seal over here too. In the carpet. I can't believe I stood there. <laughs> So these are the jackets I guess they wear when they are in Air Force One. Look at how beautiful the incorporation of fresh fruit and flowers. Just gorgeous. Wow. And then this was the different colored tulips. And then on the garland they had persimmons and pomegranates and pears. Amazing. There's the first pets and <laughs> their topiaries. They used cranberries on this tree. Look how gorgeous that turned out. 18 and a half feet tall. And the 2005 White House Christmas tree was decorated with these lilies and see how they adorned them with this glass container and volunteers would replace them each week. Can you imagine how wonderful that, that it must have smelled? This is my kind of tree. Unbelievable. Ken and I have enjoyed our time in Texas. We had dinners with our good friends Kevin and Shay. So now let me show you our room tour because we're tired. We're in Dallas, Texas. And this is the kitchen area setup that they have going. And then over here is the closet. And the bathroom's like kind of on the small side. I thought everything was bigger in Texas, no? And then in here is the bedroom. Two beds, TV, and a desk. It's a great location downtown though. So, and there's the artwork. 